And welcome back, this is Bella Scooby with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. I'm joined, as always, by my trusty squad of Cecil, Radia, and the Bard. When we last left off, we just got the Bard. I, wasn't, I was not too happy about that. Uh, we're still here in the castle. Uh, this is up at the, uh, at the third floor. You know, like Anna was lying right here. She was like, oh my god, I'm dead. That was her lines exactly. Now there are two pots here, if you remember one of the dying soldiers told us that. Uh, this one here, uh, it heals uh, your HP and your status. There are two people saying around it. What's up? You can get a along the shallows with the hovercraft. Thank you. Somebody else already told me that. The road to Fabul through Mount Hobbs is being blocked by a thick ice. Okay. And then there is another one on the other side that will heal your MP. So pretty much you have to go to, to both of them in order to heal up. And because of that, I have been doing a little level grinding. You might have caught that. I am up to level 15 with Cecil, uh, 13 with Radia, and 8 with Edward. You know, I just wanted to do a little bit uh, because, well, Edward... Yeah, he sucks. He can't even use magic. Uh, but he does come equipped with a harp, a dreamer harp, and uh, some pretty good equipment, better than anything I can replace. So, you know, might as well keep that there. I did move him to the back row, as you might expect. Uh, right here, though, she did learn a new black magic spell, and that is Toad, which works very similarly to how it worked in previous games. You turn people to toads, and while they're toads, uh, they can only cast toad, which a lot of people don't have. So it works very, very well. Now, can I? Yes. Sweet. There was definitely a building over Nya. Let us go into that building. This is the basement. But there is a man guarding it. What's up? I lost my sight. Are you my allies? Keep the treasure inside away from the enemies. And then he fades away. Which grants us access to a secret passage. Uh, there we go. And in here we can find a leather helmet, a crossbow, and a ruby ring. Awesome. Now the crossbow, uh, I would normally equip on, uh, on Rydia here, but because I still have no arrows, because I haven't been able to find a shop lately. <sighs> Gonna keep it off of her. Now this ruby ring though. This can be better than the iron ring that I have. Let's see. 8, 4, 6, 5. So more magic defense. Less, uh... Less regular defense. So 7, 10, 6, 17, 12. 17, 12 is really what I want to focus on. Let's take a look and see if this changed that at all. 17, 12, 7, 10, 6. No. Uh, so I'll keep that on her um, because she is uh, well, she, she's in the back row. So physical attacks aren't nearly as, as concerning to me with her as the, uh, as the magic attacks. But if we go in here, we can find a few Cure ones, a little bit of gold, iron arrows, white arrows. You gotta check the pots, man. You've always gotta check the pots. Life and an ether, more arrows. Nothing in this one, really. Come on. I want some more treasure. I demand one more. It must be even. So yes, the, yeah, I saw this, but you know there was no point in me getting it before. You take one, couple steps out here and. You're out on the world map. Uh, how many arrows did it actually give me? Now that I think about it. How many arrows? 20 white arrows. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and switch her over to the crossbow. 21, 16. So yes, definitely the crossbow. And we need to get on our hovercraft. And um, you'll notice they're like, oh yeah, you can go over the shallows. What do the shallows look like? They have these rocks on them. Those are shallows, apparently. And while you're on the hovercraft, you cannot get into random encounters, as I've gone over before. Is there anything over here? Oh, it looks like there are two places that we could go here. Hold on. Yeah, let's check out this one over here. I couldn't remember if... 
if you could actually do anything here. You just press, uh, well for me it's the B button, but normally it would be A to get off of here. And as you can see, there's ice here. So we can't go this way. This must be Mount Hobbs. There are random encounters here. There are bombs. <laughs> no, I do not like bombs. Uh, they don't hit very hard though. But I am going to need to use ice on these guys. I bet it'll give us a chance to look at Edward here. Uh, you go ahead and sing. You'll notice that one of his commands is to hide. When he does that, he cannot be hit. <laughs> Nothing happened. Of course not. Because you suck at singing. Damn bard. Alright, you- Oh crap, she got hit pretty damn hard. You go ahead and kill yourself, because I have nothing better for you to do. Just kind of waiting for- for Cecil's turn here. Go try- try to sing again. How did that work? And there we go, Song of Charm! Yeah, he seems to- to sing a random... song. None of which are particularly good. You get 240 gil, 370 experience, and Edward gained another level, so he's up to level 9 now. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, yeah, the songs... I mean, wh what do you want me to say? I'm not a fan of bards. Not in this game. Not in this game, ever. Let's go in here. This is the way that we can go. This is the Antlion Cave. Awesome. We can find stuff here. I'm a big fan of stuff. In particular, I'm looking for that sand ruby. Really? I I hate you. That was a very that's very misleading. And I have to go down here in order to get that. That's that's how you get the cure one though. And I did see a treasure chest over here. So let's go that way. Do we have new enemies to show off? We have turtles. Now because these are classified as lizards. Um, you know, let's just focus on that one. Because they're classified as lizards, they are going to be weak to ice. Now, you might be asking, how is Edward at fighting? Let's do it him doing regular attacks. Let's take a look. How do you do? He sucks. What did you think? But occasionally, uh, you'll get the status effect, which is definitely good. Uh, so, yeah, he fell asleep. So, if Cecil could finish him off, you get 160 gil and 160 experience. Now we can move on and move up here. Grab a cure one. Awesome. Do we have new enemies? Uh, yes, the basilisk is new. Um, what do I want to do here? You know what? Let's just go for for ice. I do believe he is also classed as a lizard and therefore weak to to ice. And then I want Edward to try to get try to get the basilisk to go to sleep because if I remember right, even in this game, the basilisk can stone you, which I don't have anything to cure right now, I don't think. Get 60 gil, 60 experience for that battle. Now, the, the imps are nothing. The imps are crap. Uh, really? I, could, I couldn't... Fine, I'll take these guys on. Let's head up these stairs here, because I did think I... Yeah, there it is. I saw another treasure chest. And it, I find more gill, which is always useful, uh, even though there's no shop for me to go in right now. Why would I want to go that way? I don't want to go that way. I want to go down here. I believe that is all the treasure chests there. Let's move on to the next floor. I don't think there... See, this looks like a secret passage right here, but there's nothing there. And I hate that. We've got creams! And we get to strike first. Um, I, if you remember, we went over this before with the little jellies and all that kind of stuff. You match the color they got! Yellow would be lightning! Go ahead and sing. Not that I really care, because Radia just kicked their ass. You get 140 gil, 200 experience, and we can move on. Let's go down here. And find ourselves another treasure chest with a life in it. Now, is this where I want to go? I cannot... Yes. Yes, it is. Because there's only a treasure chest in here. We find the Charm Harp. Now, you can't really tell that's a harp, but if you remember, that's the same thing that was on the Dreamer. So let's go ahead and equip that. Uh, let's check his stats first. I want to show you guys one. Just one that changes. So, 7-11-3-8-8. Eight, eight. 
did this change at all? 7-Eleven, 3, 8, 8. He has an attack of 11, now he has an attack of 21. It's still crap. 7-Eleven, 3, 8, 8. Damn it, it's the same. Why don't you change for me? I know you want to change for me. Yeah, finally an upgraded harp. We've had him for, for very little time, but apparently Damsian could not afford him a good harp because the first one we find is an upgrade for him. And we have, I believe these are new enemies, a sandpede and a uh, sandworm. We might have seen the sandworm before, but I don't think we have seen... Oh, he's confused. Let's go ahead and parry then. We can wait for Cecil to come in. Cecil should be able to finish him off. Yeah, down he goes. 50 gil, 56 experience. Yeah, it's not always useful to have uh, the first characters that get their turn actually go first. Creams again. And we exit the secret passage and immediately have to go pretty much the, th the way that we went through. We have weepers here. I do not like the looks of these weepers. They... Yeah, I, I don't remember these guys. Let's let's try to sing, try and fix some kind of status ailment on them. Uh, Song of Silence. That's probably going to be really damn good. Silence, of course, means they cannot use magic, so they just have to attack. They attack for pretty damn good, though. Um, you go ahead and just, I think, finish. Oh, damn! Edward suddenly got an attack. What the hell? 80 gil, 106 experience. So, yeah, that uh. That harp is better than what I had originally thought. Now, I know there was a treasure chest in here. There it is. Uh, we have seen all of you before, actually. Now, I want what's in that treasure chest. Over here, we get 250 gil. Awesome. Now, is there anything over here? No, damn you. <laughs> I thought there was. Let's go over here, then. Because I do see a treasure chest with a heal in it. I thought there was some, something else here. I can't go that way, really. I will find this other item, I swear. Actually, it looks like that's it for this room in terms of treasure, so let's go ahead and head up here where we can find another fight with creams. And through this only door we can go through, we find a save room, which is awesome. And also some treasure. We get life, ether, and a tent, which I will be using right here. Yes. Here's special field enables a tent and cabin. We've gone over this before, haven't we? I'll be right back. 